So hey everybody, I'm going to teach y'all how to cast a bait caster. So when you're practicing or whatever, trying to learn to get the hang of the back bait caster, th uh, this is my second one I've got. You want to get something like this. I don't got no hooks on it, so it's easy to cast and practice with so I don't get hooked on nothing. Uh, you could use a weight, but what I find really helpful is these, um, let me show you real quick. So, um, okay. So y'all see that little black thing I got? That's a quick connect. It's pretty easy to use. It's good to use if you like switching a bunch of baits, especially if you're fishing with the uh, lures. So, and I'm just gonna teach you the easy basics to, of the bait caster. So this right here, you can adjust your drag. That's for how you wanna let too much line out. You go this way to loosen it, and this way to tighten it. I got it adjusted to where I need it. There usually is numbers, but I've got this one. I don't know, but like I just got to sit there what's pretty tight so when I cast it don't go crazy and spool out on me. So I'm going to show you right here. So when you cast, you want to stop it right before it hits the ground, okay? Let me roll down. On this, I got a 12 pound braid. You might want to check the uh, box you get, guys. So, like, there, you might get a box or like it might say on the real mine don't, I don't think. No, it doesn't. Shows the gear, gear ratio. You might want to get the perfect one. It, there's like specified pounds of line for it, so I'm going to show you. I'm going to cast. And you really want to stop before it hits the ground. If you don't, if you don't stop before it hits the ground, you're going to backlash it. It's going to gnaw up like crazy, guys. So. I'm going to reel this in. I'm sorry, guys. I'm do, I, got, I don't got a fancy tripod. I just got my cell phone. Sorry if it's kind of windy sounding. So when you click it, you're going to get it to where it's like, doesn't let line out. Mine, of course, is loosened because I've reeled these in. But if you're just getting the hang of your bait caster, you want to have that line as tight as possible. So when you cast, you whop it. It's like, whop it. You cast as hard as you can. When you click it, boom. When like If you click it like that and just let it sit, it shouldn't be moving. So if you cast, boom, you're going to stop before it hits the ground. But if you, yeah, if you have it to where, so you're going to get this, pushed all the way forward. This where it hits um, less, like, I don't know about this one. You get it, if it has numbers, you're going to have it at like 12, I believe, is what my octane casting rod says. So yeah, I just want to teach you all the basics. Uh, comment if you want any more video ideas or like, easy tr like tips any video ideas y'all think i should do I i'll be gladly to do them i don't do videos often but yeah i just want to teach y'all how to bait cast and once you get more comfortable with it you can't loosen it up like i have so it'll go further but if you do it at first you're gonna backlash that crazy i'm not saying if you loosen it up and you just leave it like that and then you loosen it up because like oh yeah i got this down and then you loosen it a lot that's what i did when i started and i'll tell you man i, ba I backlash the sucker up and then uh, you, you'll cut your hands pulling the line, but it's not that bad unless you, like, use your noodle. If you pull really hard on that, it's going to cut you. So, yeah, this is my new bait caster. I got it at a Walmart. It was, like, for a bait caster, it was, like, 30 bucks, I believe. 30 or 20 bucks. Uh, I don't know. Nice and cheap. Works pretty good. Yeah, you can find them pretty much anywhere. For a good price, but if yeah, I recommend these a lot because you can cast them so far. And once you master the reel and get it down to zero, you're pretty much be casting across the lake, man. I'm telling you. So, this is my bait casting video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Please like and subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next one.